Second International Symposium on Fibromuscular Dysplasia and Related Diseases gathered many experts from the field from Europe, United States and Canada. During two days, the lecturers stress one thing. Fibromuscular dysplasia is a systemic disease. One of the things that makes FMD so interesting to study and so important to study is that it has such diverse clinical manifestations, ranging from high blood pressure, migraine headaches, pulsatile tinnitus, to very serious consequences like cervical artery dissection and stroke, myocardial infarction due to SCAD. For over a decade, FMDSA was the only organization in the world helping patients all over the world. And so we've grown, we've helped other groups with their endeavors, and it's important for physicians to understand the signs of FMD, uh, hypertension, the headaches, the dissection, so that they're looking for the disease so that people don't suffer consequences like they did several decades ago, including heart attack among women. So it's just wonderful to have so many researchers here today that are supporting our mission and have an interest in this disease. It's a big uh, international effort which, and with the help of uh, each of uh, you that could help to gather more and more patients uh, to have a new insight in the diagnosis and also in the pathogenesis of this disease. As a coordinator of the European International FMD Registry, I would like to highlight also the major contribution of the Arcadia Poll Initiative, which is a good example of how to develop a network with comprehensive assessment and management of fibromuscular dysplasia and related disease.